Hey, this is Matt from Dart. Wanted to reach out to you today because one question that seems to be on every driver's mind when they're considering coming to Dart is the big question. Company driver or independent contractor? Benefits, differences, what really does it all entail? So I just want to take a few minutes to go through the different points. So company driver is just like it says, you are a company employee at Dart. So you're gonna be paid your mileage rate based on years of experience up to 61 cents per mile right now. And then you'd be eligible for company benefits, vacation pay, 401k, and all those options that are available. Now, company driver, consistent. Obviously you don't need to worry about truck maintenance or anything like that. You're not paying for the fuel. You just are gonna be picking up and delivering freight, which you do best. Independent contractor. So. This is the one where we want you to think about it. So for an independent contractor, you can get a truck through highway sales, no money down, sign and drive. So great opportunity for someone that is ready to take that next step in the trucking world, but maybe doesn't have a ton of funds saved up for a down payment, no worries, they're gonna take care of you. So the things you need to think about though, if you're gonna become an independent contractor at Dart is running. So obviously as an independent contractor, we need to be concerned with your revenue. Dart has great freight, great miles, and very good line haul for you. But you obviously need to be available to run the freight. So you need to think about how you're gonna operate. Are you gonna run two weeks out? Are you gonna try to be home weekly? Because all that's gonna impact your bottom line revenue. So obviously the more miles you run, the more money you're gonna make to your truck. Maintenance, obviously as an independent contractor, maintenance is gonna be on you. So. We're gonna help you get set up with a reserve account. You put some money away in escrow to help cover things that come up. PMs, tires, oil changes, stuff like that. But then obviously we do need to be thinking in the back of our head, heaven forbid if something big happened down the line, am I gonna be ready for it? Am I prepared? Do I know what I'm gonna be doing? Through Highway Sales, they'll also talk to you about things like that, how you can get yourself set up to be successful as an independent contractor. But you gotta own it. You gotta want it. Everything you do correlates to your bottom line. If you idle your truck nonstop, you're burning your fuel because you're paying for it. Independent contractors buy their own fuel. We have great fuel discounts and stuff like that, but that is a huge thing to be mindful of. So you gotta make sure you're thinking about that. And then obviously, you know, one of the things too is taxes. So independent contractors would not have taxes taken from their pay because they're not company employees. Where obviously a company employee would lose their deductions for federal, state, any other applicable deductions. But independent contractors have the benefit where you can write certain things off. Dart partners with ATBS that we can get you set up with that they can help you manage your taxes and books and stuff like that. You would submit your receipts to them they would discuss your revenue, how you're running and stuff like that to help make sure that you're being profitable and doing the best that you can. Another important feature to think about is true truck ownership. So obviously once you complete your contract with highway sales, you're gonna own a truck. Is that what you want? Or do you just want to, in a sense, drive the truck, be done, enjoy your home time and not have to think about it? A lot of factors come into play here that some people don't think about is, you know, really what do you want out of it? Well, obviously we want you here at Dart, you want to be at Dart, but you got to make sure that you're setting yourself up to be successful with what you think is going to be best for your situation. If you know that unfortunately you might have some stuff coming down the pipeline that you might need some time off for. Independent contractor, that's going to affect your bottom line revenue. Are you going to be at risk of going into the hole? Or are you going to have enough of a reserve account built up to take that time off you need? Where a company driver, you would just work with your fleet manager and obviously get your time off approved and not have to worry about any type of truck payment. So it really is gonna come down at the end of the day to what you want out of it. If your goal is you wanna be the boss, then absolutely, let's go independent contractor right away, get going. If you think, well, maybe I should explore the freight lane and see how it goes and stuff like that, come on company driver, test us out, and if it's what you like, we can still get you set up through highway sales, and then they can get you into a truck when you're ready. So either way, there's great options available. It's just you gotta think about what you really want as an operator here at Dart. And I'm sure you've got questions that I haven't mentioned briefly. 
Give us a call. I'm happy to talk to you. Anyone downstairs in the recruiting department is happy to talk to you. Give us a call. Let's have a conversation. We can explore what's going to be best for you in your situation right now. Once again, if you have any additional questions, feel free to reach out to myself or any member of the recruiting team. Also, feel free to check out other videos online. Make sure you click subscribe. We're going to have more stuff coming down the pipeline. And then also, don't forget, you can follow us on all social media platforms, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, TikTok, we're everywhere. So we'll talk to you soon.